Now, the church is a house of worship for believers, but politicians are turning the pulpit into a political stage. Politicians call to speak many a, many a times, say they won't talk politics in church, but their speeches take a sharp bend more often than not. But even as some preachers call for respect for the pulpit, others have been drawn into the world of politics. Melita Oletengas reports. Congregation of the faithful gather in different churches across the country every Sunday to worship. Among the faithful in several instances are top politicians who are considered special guests. However, whereas many Christians contend that politics and Sunday worship are like oil and water and they just don't mix, some clerics preach water and drink wine, granting politicians a platform for politics. Why are you pushing this housing agenda? What is these houses? Who told you we need a house? You, you, you don't need to be talking too much. You are talking to, like, to a, a dead woman which is not, not listening to you. Mimi ni mwana azimio. Na hapa mimi niko. Mimi siyo mutapeli wa kuruka huku na kuruka huku. Serekali mechagua ni serekali yenu. There is a thin line between just greeting the church and politicking. Mwejibio uru kinjeta ya nituambia. And even when they promise they will avoid politics, when they take to the pulpit, they forget immediately. Perhaps goldfish memory. And you use religion to cover yourself as a politician. You know, that's dangerous. And you even make Christianity really look bad. Unfortunately, the church seems to be in bed with government. They seem to have benefited from government in the fundraisings, in the brown envelopes. The church has become a beneficiary of state. Clergy have become brokers, political bro brokers. However, it seems to be a habit that has been getting worse over time. The current politicking in church is a sharp contrast of the late presidents Daniel Moy and Moai Kibaki leadership styles. In many cases, Moy would address the media after a church service outside the church, and Moai Kibaki would often shorten his speech in church. A very happy New Year, and I want you to begin this New Year. The position of the church has been questioned in allowing the political circus to continue, much to the chagrin of the faithful, a majority who feel that politicians should shape up. The fact that there is no law that prohibits church politics means the buck stops with the clergy, who dictate who takes to the pulpit. Milita, Oletenges, NTV.